Griffin Hoverwork has sold more than 150 craft in over 39 countries in six continents. With a strong track record in supplying military customers, we understand your needs and can provide the right craft for your operational requirements. Hovering just above the surface of water or land gives the hovercraft two key advantages, amphibious operation and high speed. I think they're great. I think they are one of the best bits of kit going. Our hovercraft will travel at 30 or 40 knots straight over water or over obstacles up to half a metre high. Sandbanks, rocks, vegetation, anything like that does not affect hovercraft operations at all. And actually, the hovercraft just lap it up. As commanders, it gives us huge flexibility because we can use nearly any beach that we want to. The last thing we actually want to do is drop our troops into the water and they have to wade ashore. They start off whatever operation, wet and cold. A hovercraft can take them to the top of the beach quickly, easily, drop down, they unload their kit and off they go. The Royal Marines confirm that their hovercraft noise signature when running towards a beach is less than their conventional raiding boats. The Royal Marines have operated a fleet of Griffin Hoverwork hovercraft for over 15 years now in a world of ever-changing challenges. Before this campaign, we were a raiding squadron, which meant we did not go on opposed beaches. We were covert, quiet operations where we put troops in, they go ashore, take out the target, retract back to us, and it's all covert, all done, slow time, quietly. Now out here, we've become an assault squadron. And we're going into opposed areas where people have the upper hand. Griffin Hoverwork has responded to these changing needs by equipping the next generation of Royal Marines hovercraft with more power, more firepower and removable armoured defences. Hovercraft give commanders enormous flexibility of operations. Our smallest craft, the 380TD, can launch from its road trailer on any unprepared beach or slipway and take the direct line to intercept regardless of terrain. It's ideal for special forces or paramilitary operators. All of our hovercraft produce virtually no wash or wake signatures at speed. And the craft can hide in the radar clutter on a beach, undetected by other marine radar. In Arctic regions, our 2000 TD craft enable coast guards and border police to patrol remote frozen coastlands in Sweden, Finland, Lithuania and Estonia. All of these craft are relied upon to secure their country's borders in temperatures as low as minus 35 degrees Celsius. The larger 8000 TD is in service with the Indian Coast Guard and the Saudi Arabian Border Guard operate five 8000 TDs which have been configured to carry a vehicle or equipment in the bow. The Canadian Coast Guard have four large craft in service patrolling both the east and west coasts. Each of our hovercraft is tailored to fit the exact needs of individual customers and can incorporate personnel seating, a mess area, galley and toilet, a crane, firefighting equipment or full mine countermeasures. Royal Navy tests have proved that hovercraft are virtually immune to sea mines. Operating where no other vessel can venture, at high speed and with solid reliability, Griffin Hoverwork Hovercraft can give you the advantage in the close inshore environment.